this patient requested correction of her droopy upper eyelids and aging brow appearance. The patient also requested that the procedure was performed under local anesthesia with mild sedation. After careful and accurate surgical markings were made, the excess skin in the upper eyelids was excised. Per patient's request, a more dominant upper eyelid crease was created with special internal sutures. The eyelid creases were checked for positioning and symmetry. The upper eyelid incisions were closed with a fine suture. This type of incision usually heals with a nearly imperceptible scar. There are a few different methods to perform a brow lift. In this particular case, a partial pretracheal approach was selected. Careful skin elevation was performed under direct vision. Special instruments are used to meticulously estimate skin excess. The incision is closed with some deep sutures and fine skin sutures. The final scar fades quite nicely in due time. Here is the patient at the end of the procedure. She has a pleasing, more youthful upper eyelid appearance and properly positioned eyebrows. She was quite comfortable throughout her procedure. The skin sutures will be removed between five and seven days after surgery. She is expected to have minimal bruising.